Hello everyone, I'm Future Guitar Hero back, and welcome to another episode of Looney Tunes Sheepdog and Wolf. In the last episode, we completed level 5 and the annoying level 6. Yeah, <laughs> that, no seriously, that was really annoying. It, it took like half an hour of the original recording, probably 40 minutes in fact of the original recording to record the whole thing, because the whole thing ended up being like 55 minutes, and then I cut it down to 41. But I should say that this isn't. This is recorded before the previous episode was uploaded. So, yeah. Anyways, let's get started with the seventh level. I'm pretty sure it was because I think I tried a six before, and then we've done a, the sixth level last. So, anyways, long way. <laughs> Already failing. <laughs> yeah. So. Okay, here's one, and you're probably gonna uh, you're gonna get some like. Um, cool things that. Okay, I'm standing in the lava. That is awesome! <laughs> uh, so, anyways, let's go through. Oh, wait, no, this wasn't the one I was thinking of. Okay, so. So, yeah, but it wasn't the one I was thinking of. I'm just waiting for the flyby to be over so I can start. I haven't actually uh, played this one, but I've seen someone else do it. So let me think. If I, I think it showed that if I was to get sucked into these, then I'd go out another one. So yeah. Up. Oh, obviously. What? What the hell? Uh, where the hell do I go? I have no idea, I've never played this level, so, yeah. So, I can't really go there, so let's see. And it goes over here, okay, so, let's see. Um, so, if you stand on top of here, get launched there, and then, ah, oh yeah. Okay, we get we sent back here. Okay, got it. So that just leads up. Okay, and we gotta push this to block one of the guises. I'm pretty sure it was. Oh yeah. And then I bet that's really loud. So yeah. There you go. You know, I love this guitar work in the recording, so let's see. Umbrella. Yeah, yeah, I bet a few of you can probably guess what that's for. So, I think I know what it's for, I just can't quite remember because I haven't played this level before, as I said a few times. But, oh my god, this type of thing! Oh, wait, 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 wait. Let me see. Okay, so, we push that. Um, okay, if I were to move that, which I can, but, um, then, let me see, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to get, okay, yeah, this is the way I'm supposed to go. So there's a crane, um, up, damn it, okay, I'm underneath the ice cube, yeah. <laughs> I love how there's Daffy Duck in there, I just realized. <laughs> okay. It's grabbing us, finally. And then... There. Now I got a... Spam X. There. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see, I think I'm supposed to... No, ah, what the hell? Okay, so, where do I go then? Uh, that's where I came from. And, over here. Um. Let me see, there's nothing up there. I can't get up there anyways. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, that was just a different coloring for some reason. Um, let's see, can I do this? Whoa! 
Okay, I'm not sure if this is how you do it, but okay. So there's where the sheep go is. Wait, what? Okay. Oh, bad up mistake. Yep. I feel that would happen. But yeah, sucks for it. So we respawn back here now. We were supposed to get a sheep, I'd say, but where the hell do we get one? Um Camera angle, stop! Let me see what I'm trying to do. For God's sakes. Oh wait, there's there's a way here. Um Yeah, I'm probably missing the whole thing and Camera angles! You're not letting me see what I'm supposed to do. Damn it. Ah. Now I gotta wait for it again. Okay, there we go. Ah. Seriously? Well, at least it did that, so. Do that. Oh, there's a sign here, obviously. Umbrella recommended. We have an umbrella. Yeah. Mary Poppins style and up. Yeah, obviously. That would happen. <laughs> frozen, defrosted, and refrozen again. <laughs> Come on. Warm up fast, there we go. So, um. Oh, oh there, yeah, there. Okay, so let's see. Okay, so we're supposed to spam the jump button basically. Okay, so I got it. I, I think. So we go over here. We gotta spam the jump button, spam it. Up. Oh my god, we fight. we managed to make it. I didn't think we managed would be able to. Let's go again. So here. Oh, there you are. Most of these are like close calls, so <laughs> yeah. Okay, over here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Sam's area. Deactivate. Let's see, what do we do here? Okay, he's got no sheep. Oh wait, no, his sheep are behind there, I forgot. So let's see. Okay. Oh wait, no, it's supposed to float above, I'm pretty sure. Oh! Accidentally hit the X button instead of the jump button. Ah! <sighs> I mean, somehow managed to dodge it by just like jumping, spam jumping. So. Sadly, you can't step in the air, and I think I saw a time clock. Let me see. Ah, camera angle! Yeah, there's a time clock. Okay, so, let's see. So, up here, put away this, and then, what's in, up, no, 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 no. Damn it. So, what's in here? Of course, it would go in there. Oh, it's a head right, okay. So, let's see. We're supposed to do this. Just to block it. I was going to do that just to make sure. There you go. And now we've got this. Oh! Okay, chain reaction. Okay. Where is this? Where is okay, it's right there. Okay, I'm back here, okay. I see. So now let's see if we can do this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ha! Ah, <laughs> he's dancing right there. Let me just go back here. 
So I'm surprised I haven't been caught by Sam yet, as in, like, being strangled by Sam. I know I've been seen by him, but not strangled, but, yeah, now let's see, there we go. It's actually similar to Doodle Jump, this type of thing. Okay, that just does the... <laughs> uh, let's see. Okay, this is the way up here, or a way. Put that away. Before I do something stupid with it. Okay, that just leads back to there, okay. So... This was Sam's area again, yeah. I'm going back in circles, obviously, because I tend to do that a lot. And... I wish I could go over there to the time clock instantly. Um, heh, let's get it instantly, time clock. Yeah, but never did, never mind. Okay, so, um, let me think. I think I'm supposed to, let me just go over there. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh, okay, because the guys just ran out and I didn't want to be caught, so, yeah. So, wait for him, good. Now you go. I get sucked into there, ha! And we get gone into here, so, now what we have to do, I remember this from the tutorial, is the one from the, okay, right here. And that takes us right here. So now we can. Uh, let's see. I think what he did in the tutorial was just jump off into the water. I can't remember. Yeah, that happens. Okay. And let's see. Oh, camera angles. There you go. So I'm pretty sure this is what happened. So. Wait for this, obviously, because it takes a while. There we go. So that's why we got the hair dry, because the sheep is not able to squirm out like us, so... Yeah. Okay. Squirm, squirm, It probably sounds really... Yeah, I don't know. Well, I got a daffy, he's just getting a full-time job there trying to catch that ice and it keeps falling off. So, let's see. Activate. Okay, there we go. So, now we get to... Okay. Camera angles, I can barely see... Okay, this is what we're supposed to do. So... So let me think, how do we do this? Um, I think put that there. Uh, let's see. Put that there. That there. Actually, let me grab that and then put the lettuce again. Okay, there we go. Okay, so up. Oh, let me grab that one. Um, let's see. So then go over here, park above these, and then let's see. So. Then run over here. Up oh, quickly. Okay, so then move over here. Oh no 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 no! No! Not safe. Yep. Yeah. Okay, so now it's safe. 
good. So finally done this level. I don't know how long I've been recording for, so yeah. At least it hasn't lagged at all. So I'm pretty sure next level is the favourite level of mine. So let's get that because that cutscene you already know and I don't know. Okay, this next one is definitely the one where it's my favourite one. One of my favourite ones, I should say. Oh yeah, I haven't actually even got the time clock from there. I forgot, so I don't know how to. So I'll get to that later. And that was weird. That door just glitched. So, anyways, go over here and through here. And right here, level eight. You may be able to guess, possibly, I don't know, that it involves time travel, which is flippin' amazing. So I that sounded like, sound like cussing, but I don't think it is. But anyways, now I get to see Ralph Hall's fear of heights, even though he's just touching the ground there, which is kind of funny. <laughs> yeah, that. So let's see. What the? Two this time. Awesome. We get a what looks like a seed. Yep, seed. And then a magical chronometer. Or chronometer, I don't know. Chronometer probably. Oh yeah, I forgot. Uh so first of all, we are going to put the we are going to use the magical chronometer. And it doesn't do much, just turn back time. I mean Seriously, that's awesome. Who needs a DeLorean and then, uh, what is it? Who needs a DeLorean and plutonium and 88 miles per hour? You can just have one of those. Okay, so let's see. Yep, there we go. So now we can grab the seed, put it onto this soil right here. And I gotta just grab the stalk there. And he goes here. Okay, he's getting sucked into the wrong area. <laughs> uh, yeah. And don't ask me how that tree there that just appeared is still standing after apparently 1,000 years. And actually, let's see, can I wait for several centuries to die on the tree? Yeah. So it's like go back, goes back to prehistoric times. Apparently, that magical phenomenon, which is pretty awesome. I'm not going to lie. So, there's the time clock right there. Awesome. Now we can turn back time again. Oh, use it here. By the way, I should mention on the PSX version or PS1 version, whatever you like to call it, PS, um, it has like a different transition and it's faster. That's the only time the PSX version is better um, than the PC version. So yeah. Yep. And now we have changed history a second time. So yeah. Call that a time paradox if you want to, I don't I don't think it is, but anyways. Uh let's see. So now we get to swim again. Dive bomb or cannonball it was actually doing, I don't know. Jump or swim up. And then, oh wait, no, that's not how I do it. How do I do it in, when I originally did it in the trial version? Let me think. Well, well, camera angles. <sighs> okay, go back here. Oh wait, wait, wait. What I'm supposed to do? Da. Use a magical chronometer again to turn back time and cause another paradox, if you want to call it. So yeah, oh, go to ya. So you put that there, and now get sucked back into the future with a black dot there. 
And we have changed history again for the third time. Now I can grab these. Um, up, oh, come on. And grab these these leafy vegetables. Yup. Um, <sighs> yeah, I'm bringing back that um, thing again. That rapper joke. No, seriously, he does sound like a rapper. That Porky Pig in the earlier episode, like the first episode, I think it was. So, anyways, magical phenomena again. Cause another paradox, I guess. Why not? So we have to. And again, I'm hoping that you can hear me. I just, yeah. So now we take that, and then we move it over here. Getting sucked into the wrong place again. And now we have a giant tree here. Now I can get launched over here. And this, there's where Sam's flock is. Oh, sheep. So, we'll take the magical chronometer, and if you saw in the cutscene, there was a, a dragon there. Spoilers. Yeah. Um, but, eh, that dragon's gonna be, well, you'll see. Yeah. He's just gonna appear and uh, randomly and then start attacking you, so. Oh, yeah, you gotta wait for him to get closer and then suck him into the time portal. And that lava spirits. Stuck in the air. So now we have the dragon brought with us as well. And now have a look what happens. This is pretty badass. Of, yeah. Not that, but. <laughs> God, I love that. It's like, who the hell needs guns and knives and shouts? Real men just grab them by the necks and throw them into orbits. Yeah. Like a boss. So. Yeah, that's pretty awesome of Sam to help us, but anyways. Now all we need to do is just push these boulders. Because in the present time, and you want to make sure you don't get hit by any of these, um, what is it, um, what, what were they, the, um, lava things. So the, um, flying lava spit. I don't know what you'd like to call it. Um, cause I'll show you what happens. That. Yeah, you just start running crazy. And you can't stop it until it burns out. And chances are you'll fall into lava, which is where... Damn it! Let's just keep running around. Oh, whoa, whoa. not near the lava, exactly. Okay. Damn you! Why must you be like that? Yeah, they all seem to be around about equal distance. So, yeah. Hopefully this episode doesn't take too long either. But yeah, as I said before, I haven't uploaded the, pre the previous episode of recording yet. So, yeah. That's good to know. Wait for it. Hide behind there. And then go right here. Oh, come on. Stop glitching. It's really annoying when it glitches. Like, super. So, let's do this, and do this, and that, and then we can go right here, yep, there we go, now we are safe, and there's a ball over there, obviously, because it would just have to be there, duh, so, yeah. There's... Now let's see, how do we... Okay, wait, 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 wait. Here's what we do. 
magical phenomena and phenomena, and I just realized I haven't actually, actually, let me think. I'm going to guess that I need to. Uh, I don't know. Ah, oh, there's a red thing over there. Yeah. I think it's called Gossamer. I can't quite remember exactly though. So, go up here. If we can. Grab X. And then. Okay, uh, let me think. Yeah, I haven't actually finished this one either, so. Let me think. How do I do this? There's a black dot up there. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I landed on the actual thing. Thing in the, the way it I don't know. Um, let's see. Okay, so we've got this. Now we jump up here. If we can, hopefully. Yeah! And then, let's see, what does this say? Nervous will avoid wearing red clothes. It'll make him very upset. That's a hint. So let's see. This is going to be right near the Gossamer. So it's going to be kind of... Yeah. But we actually do have to do that. And of course the Gossamer would be guarding the thing we need. So now he's going to start chasing us. Oh no 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 Okay now bring him closer to the portal and there we go. Now it's gonna get sucked into the portal as well. And now he's travelled a thousand years and he's now officially a thousand years old. No, it's kidding. Oh what Okay, now we get that. And now he's gonna start chasing the the gossamer forever. It is, uh, he just rams his butt there. This is quite dizzying, but <laughs> whatever. And now we go here and make sure not to get ran by them, because yeah. So now we got a seed, a magical seed. We go over here. Let's run up here, and let's see. Take the magical chronometer again. And okay, now we take the seed. In fact, I wonder if you were to put a lettuce back in this dimension, I wonder if it'll still be there in the future. Yeah, I know, I wouldn't think so. Although then again, it is Looney Chin, so yeah, I wouldn't I wouldn't be at all surprised if they actually did still exist after a thousand years of probably rotting away. Yeah, yeah. Anyways, anyways. but <laughs> still chasing it. So now, let's see. Um, okay, that's the place where you put the sheep. Um, so let's see. Um, now, we need to grab some, we need to get closer, and then go over here, and obviously that would happen, that just had to happen, cause he's like that. I don't understand why he'd be like that, because, yeah. Now, let's see. All I need to do is just get close to his area, like there. Just right there. So then, shot after he looks away. And then, let's see, can I attract any sheep with this? Oh, yeah. Don't exactly want you on that side, but yeah, I think we can persevere with it. Okay, now he nicked off with the ship, and he's too dumb to notice the thing. So 
Let's see, now, how do we do this? I can't remember. Um, let's see, oh, wait. Grab that, a plant. Um, how do we do this again? I cannot remember. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, I, I think I know what to do, because that's why this thing is there. So, obviously that sheep won't be there in the past, so we don't have to worry about that. So, yeah. But we do have to worry about... Oh my god, I didn't think I'd be able to do that, so... Oh, come on. Seriously? Seriously? What? Nah, I was kidding. <laughs> I think I might have actually moved the ship over, I'm not exactly sure though, but let's move the magical chronometer portal time travel thingy to Lori and back to the future reference thingy, whatever. <laughs> um, so yeah. Whoa. Let's try this. So what we have to do, and we can take that seed if we want. And then do that. So it gets sucked into there. And then wait a while. A long while, in fact. Because it's a thousand years, but whatever. Um, even though time travel doesn't exactly work like that. But now we have the rock, which we can... I think we can jump on. Yep. And then put that there. And then put the sheep there. And now... And actually, I had to keep the thing up there. Oh, wait, 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 can I, can I jump up like that? Camrangles! Hell yeah, who needs trees when you can have seesaws? Okay. Okay, the sheep's all safe. So, now what we have to do... Is go over here... And we're nearly done with this level, don't worry. And then go over here. Get into the inside so that they can't hurt us. And goal! So there's my favorite level right there. Mainly because of the fact that it has time travel. I mean, seriously, who cannot like try things that have time travel in them? Yeah, I can't really beatbox. Yeah, I should stop, I stop doing that. Yeah. God, I love that. But anyways, I think that's going to do it for this episode. So that was the level 7 and 8. So next we'll be doing level 9 and possibly one or two more. I don't know. So I'll see you then. I'll see you next time. Peace! Peace.